Hello friends, welcome back to my channel PMRT HRD. Today we are going to discuss about one subject that is very close to my heart, that is law of attraction. I came across with this concept uh, something around three to four years back when I was invited to attend one training program by Professor R. Mangesh Das. From that training program, I came to know about uh, this concept and uh, I have used it number of times. I was also successful. Law of attraction totally based on a lot of techniques. It is not like uh, that if I am thinking of it, I am writing uh, about it, I will get it. You have to work on it. Lot of people uh, must have uh, used this concept and uh, uh, they may be successful. There may be some people who are not successful. That's because how much intentions we are giving to our thoughts and how much it is reality. Friends, law of attraction based on the philosophy that is Positive th thinking gives positive results and negative thinking gives negative results. Jesa drishti, Vesa drishti. In Indian concept it is karma, in Western concept it is positive thoughts. Thoughts and feelings work together, attracts desire. Everything depends or starts with a thought. Every thought is manifesting. Every thought creates a feeling and all feelings put together, it becomes attitude. And attitude used number of times, it becomes habit. And all habits put together, it becomes my personality. And my personality comes into action in my daily life. You must have experienced a lot of people who are very positive in any kind of situation. And there are people also, even in very positive situation, they find some negative things. Critical thinkers. Law of attraction says, your thoughts should be very positive. You should not have any doubt on your intentions or your desires. I'll give an example how it works. Suppose you are working in a very a junior position in a company. After seeing all these, uh, you know, uh, facilities and all things, you also have a desire to become a general manager of that company. And you heard about lot of uh, law of attraction, so you you are thinking that universe will, universe will going to give me this, so I'm going to do this, manifest it. But when you are thinking of it, you are doing it, you are started doing it. But when you are thinking of it, when you are writing, you feel like, is it possible? Our, our management is going to promote me to the general manage, manager position. The doubts arise in your mind. When doubt arises, you cannot feel that position. Law of attraction says, what you want to be, you should feel it in the present. But your feeling is not matching with your desire now. So it will not work. But if you feel, if you, are man if you manifest, today I am working as a uh, junior position, I want to be a senior. Junior executive to senior executive. Now this is my qualities. As a senior executive, these are the qualities required. There is hardly any difference. I will work on it and I will get that position. Now you started feeling that position because already you are into that position. So there is a little difference. So you started feeling that position. When you feel that position, the positive vibration comes. And in, in regularly, continuously, you are, you are working to develop yourself skillfully. So in, when you are working to uh, on the particular subject, you are giving a lot of intention to it. When you give a lot of intention to it, you are going to get it. 
law of attraction it's not like that if i desire anything to everything i'm going to get it no you have to work on it you have to develop yourself to that extent suppose i i want to one crore rupees now now i am hardly my salary is 10000 rupees i i never seen even 50 lakh rupees all together but i am i am manifesting for 1 crore rupees then the doubt itself comes into my mind if i get 1 crore rupees what i am going to do with this when i am not clear about it i do not know there are a lot of confusion in my mind so it will not happens if i work on it if i am going to get 1 crore rupees this is what 1 crore rupees is and if i am going to get it what if i am going to get it then i am going to buy a house this much i am going to buy uh, i am going for uh, for the studies for this much so these are the things i have to work on it when i am started working on all those things simultaneously i am developing myself i am widening widening my vision i am i am developing a strategy for myself when you i will give an my example uh, some 3 years back i as i told you i was almost 84 kilo there are a lot of words in my body and i have tried lot of things like uh, whatever i read anywhere and uh, whatever videos i saw uh, how to lose weight and all those things i have done lot of things but never worked what i did i manifest for to reduce myself to an extent at least for 20 to 20 plus kg but in two days in one month is it possible unless i have done anything drastically which is not good for my health it may put my life in at risk what i did the 20 kg reduction was in my mind i started working on it slowly i started uh, yoga then i started running and continuously from uh, early morning i used to get up and uh, i do running then slowly i have started participating in the marathons also then i read lot of books uh, Uh, and saw videos about uh, running how to build up stamina and i have started working in uh, working on it from last 2 to 3 years then i uh, joined some gyms to uh, develop my strength started trekking because if i sit at home uh and thinking of uh, reducing the weight it will never happen i have to work on it then i have control my diet also today i have reduced 22 kg and i took 3 years in a very slow process but i have done it so when you uh, think of something be positive and i was very positive and i knew it will take time and systematically and healthier way you have to do it so i have done in that way only there are some other examples also when i was in need of some finance also i have done it and i got it also but that was also a limited i never never uh, thought of a huge amount of money which i myself can't able to manage i'll give you another example if i today i want a car if i am going to manifest for a car like bmw and my earning per year is supposed to be 10 lakh rupees am i going to manage it i i may get a car by a personal loan or 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 vehicle loan whatever available in the market but after that how am i going to manage it 
your your backing has to be there you may manifest you may get it but how you are going to manage it so that 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 uh, that doubt definitely is going to come into the mind when doubts are coming law of attraction doesn't work if i i have not seen uh, the i i don't have uh, idea about maruti 800 but i am thinking of uh, mercedes bmw it's always good to have higher thoughts but to manage to maintain i should have backup also i can manifest for a smaller vehicle which i may get and can i can manage so friends law of attraction definitely works and it works if we technically use it uh, there are a lot of clients also uh, who have used these techniques and they have also successful uh, thank you uh, this much today and uh, we'll come back with more topics on human resource and law of attractions also be with my channel if you have not subscribed please do subscribe thank you so much